come to the third and final semi-final contest. At the end of the second semi-final, I mentioned to you, our viewers, that the final semi-final contest will be between three schools that had the three highest scores in, at the quarter-final stage. Already, their fans have kept the auditorium very charged. And I know that the contestants will do nothing but their very best. The last ticket for our final is up for grabs. Golden Star, Bogos, Golden Star Basic School from Bogoso, St. Anthony of Padua, Calic JHS from Kwesimin Team, and Barbara International School from Apramdo. They say we should stay tuned in for the very best. I am Albert Ababio. I will be your quiz master. Before we go on to our contestants, for them to introduce themselves to us, I would like to appreciate our proud sponsors. The 2022 edition of the Connect Cowbell Western Best Brains Quiz Competition is proudly sponsored by our headline sponsor, Cowbell. Cowbell has come out with five new flavors. These include Cowbell Mocha, Cowbell Strawberry, Cowbell Banana, Cowbell Coconut, and Cowbell Chocomote. Cowbell, our milk. Our supporting sponsors are Youth Bridge Foundation, Seven Star Natural Mineral Water, Top Choco, Kel Charcoal Toothpaste, and McBerry Biscuits. This program, the CCWBB, is in partnership with the Ghana Education Service and St. John Senior High School. St. John Senior High School have hosted us for all three semi-final contests. And now to our contestants. From Golden Star Basic School, on my immediate left, we have... Mensa Atasan, final year. Mukti Dixon, final year. Let me ask them, what are your expectations for today's contest? This is a competition, and in every country, you don't lose, you either learn or win. St. Anthony of Padua, our defending champions, are represented by Elizabeth De Baker Dutton. It's for the area of KDK. Bomb three. Elizabeth and Kingsford, you agree with me that you have a Westferos support base. What would you tell them before the start of the contest? We promise you we will bring back the trophy to St. Anthony of Padua. Barbara International School is represented by Edwin Ayuzoya, second year. Anastasia Kwanza, final year. Edwin and Anastasia, you have heard from the other competitors. What message? do you have for them we came here for victory and nothing else so the contestants came here for victory i have one job and one job only to pose them the questions and to rule whether the questions are correct or not so i would also want to bounce off them the rules of engagement contestants this quiz comes to you in four rounds in round one, you would have questions in English language and social studies. Round two will be dedicated to questions from science. In round three, you would have questions from mathematics. In round four, which is our power round, we will test your abilities in current affairs or general knowledge. For a question correctly answered from round one to three, it is worth three points if it's your major question. If it is a bonus, it is worth one point. If for any reason, you give an incorrect answer and it is you are going for a bonus you lose a precious point in all three rounds there will be tossed in questions and for the first question answered at the first attempt in the sourcing questions or the, that segment you earn four points if it is incorrect you lose a precious point that particular question will be up for grabs the two remaining schools the first to ring it in this particular instance, you will be the second attempting it. You earn three points if you get it correct. 
and you lose a precious point if you get it incorrect. And finally, if the two schools fail to get the tossing questions attempted, the third school will be asked to ring for it. If they get it right, two points. If they get it wrong, negative one, or they'll lose a precious point. I hope the rules of engagement are clear. A preamble to all schools. Complete these proverbs appropriately. One attempt only. Ten seconds within which to give an answer. Golden star. The busiest man Is the world yes? Is the world yes? That is incorrect. For a bonus, you've been bailed out. The busiest man finds the most leisure. St. Anthony of Padua. Pleasure has a sting. Plead. Into the microphone, please. Plead. No. For a bonus, pleasure has a sting in its tail. Barbara International. Politeness costs little or nothing. To get. That is incorrect for a bonus. But that is correct. For a bonus. The same preamble. The same preamble. The same preamble. Golden stab. Many words hurt. The camel going to seek horns. Your own loses it. Yes. That is correct. <laughs> to you, Barbara International. There is no rose without a tongue. That is correct. The next set, again, 10 seconds, preamble to all schools. Complete the following with appropriate prepositions. To you, Golden Star Basic School. This vase is made dash glass. It's made of. That is correct. St. Anthony of Padua. Mrs. Ape is blind. That's the fault of her children. Because of. That is incorrect for a bonus. The answer to Mrs. Ape is blind to the fault of her children. Your own question, Barbara International. We have dash sugar, so we cannot have breakfast. Later. I will take that. The next set, I will start with you. And this is from Social Studies. Golden Star Basic School. In the formation of metaphoric rocks, which original rock changes to graphite? Granite. No, for a bonus. The bell of Barbara International. Yes. Sedimentary rock. That is incorrect. The answer is coal. St. Anthony of Padua. Which substance binds the various layers together in the formation of sedimentary rocks? Sediment. Sediment. Se sediment, no. For a bonus. You've all been bailed out. It is the matrix or cement or cement matrix. To you, Barbara International. Which rock changes to marble in the formation of metaphoric rocks? Art. For a bonus. St. Anthony of Padua. Limestone. Limestone is correct. Bogoso, Golden Star Basic School, Bogoso. On what date is the sun vertically overhead? 
on the tropic of cancer Twenty. Twenty first. Not 21st December for a bonus. Barbara International. 21st March. That is incorrect. The answer is 21st June. What is to you, St. Anthony of Padua? What is the exact date on which the sun is overhead at midday along the Tropic of Capricorn? 21st March. That is incorrect for a bonus. Barbara International. 21st December. That is correct. Your main question, Barbara International. What is the opposite of equinoxes? For a bonus. The answer is solstices, spelled S-O-L-S-T-I-C-E-S. -E Your main question, Golden Star Basic School. What will happen if Kofi travels eastwards across the international date line? A day will be... A day will begin. A day will begin. That is incorrect. For a bonus. A day will begin. A day will be day. That is the same answer they give. A, Kofi will lose a day. Kofi will lose a day. A country in the east, St. Anthony of Padua, a country in the east is four hours ahead of Ghana. On which longitude can we locate that country? 60 degrees. You said 60 degrees. I won't give you the mark. Sorry to the other schools for not passing it on. To you, Barbara International, the great circle divides the earth into two equal halves. How do we call these halves? The tropic region is found in between which two great circles? Barbara International. Pardon me. The tropic of. I can't hear you. The tropic of. The. I'll pass it on. Golden Star answer. The Northern and Southern Hemispheres. The Northern and Southern Hemispheres. That is correct. So we've got into the tossing segment. You complete these proverbs appropriately. Please, if you ring the bell, keep your hand on the buzzer and let me call you. Get my attention, eh? Oaks may fall when. Oaks may fall when Oaks may fall when reeds stand the storm. Reeds, reeds, R E E D S. The next one. Give a fool a rope enough, and he will hang them, international hang themselves. Hang themselves. He is lifeless that he is lifeless that he is lifeless that faultless. The final one he is not fit to command others that command himself. He is not fit to command others that command himself. So you give me the nearest in meaning to this particular one. We lamented over poor treatment at our workplace. Bogoso. Regretted. Regretted. No. Golden um Barbara International. Wept. I'll take wept. Yeah. Preamble, please listen to the following extract carefully and answer these questions. The fair breeze blew, the white foam flew, 
the Pharaoh followed free. We were the first that burst into the silent sea. The main sound device used in the stanza is Barbara International. I will move on. The answer is alliteration. Please, if you ring and you don't have an answer ready, I will move on. The device helps to express sweetness. Sweetness. I will take that. <laughs> Social studies. Which tribe in Ghana, as far as migration is concerned, is associated with the old Ghana Empire? The Akans. Barbara International. The Akans. The Akans. The main types of vegetation found in the southwestern part of Ghana is Barbara International. Delicious. The Delicious. No. Rain uh, Rainfall. No, please. One attempt only. St. Anthony of Padua. Bogoso. Sally Deciduous Rainforest. No. St. Anthony of Padua. Why semi deciduous? No. Hmm. Simply rainforest. Which eclipse occurs between the sun and the moon? Which eclipse occurs when the earth comes between the sun and the moon? Golden star. Solar eclipse. That is not correct. St. Anthony of Padua. Lunar eclipse. That is correct. Ashanti or Asante was colonized by the British through two Where? Saint Antonio of Padua. True conquest. True conquest. I won't take that. By force. By force is correct. The final question: What is the difference between leisure and tourism? Leisure is the normal day from work or normal duties for relaxation, recreation activity. And many more whilst tourism is traveling or traveling to enjoy facilities but facilities and places or sceneries. That is correct. So <laughs> tourism leisure is freedom provided by the cessation of activities, and that is why you said break from work. And then tourism is the act of traveling or sightseeing. And you mentioned that traveling to see places. So that brings us to the end of the first round. Dad, including mocha, Kaba has five flavors. Banana, strawberry, chocomalt, coconut. What's the fifth one? Banana. Banana? Okay, Dad. Including mocha, Cabo has five flavors. Banana, strawberry, chocomalt, and coconut. What is the fifth one? Strawberry. No. <laughs> uh, are you feeling hot? Honey, including mocha, Cabo has five flavors. Strawberry, banana, chocomalt, coconut. What's the fifth one? Chocomalt. Hey! Coconut. Hey! Nutritious and refreshing, Cowbell has a flavor for everyone. They think I don't know. This advert is FDA approved. Hello, my friends. My name is Kelkit Toothpaste. Wow. I was made to be gentle on your gum, but protected. I will protect your teeth from cavity. Make your teeth whiter, stronger. Keep your mouth fresh all day. And best of all, I'm strawberry flavored. So put on a smile and try me. That's amazing. Just try me. That's my job. If you say so, jump on my brush. Make your teeth stronger. Chicky, chicky, whiter. Chicky, chicky, stronger. I'm glad you like your new toothpaste. Don't forget to brush both day and night. Girl kids, happy smile.
gratitude to our main sponsor, Cowbell Our Milk, and supporting sponsors, Youth Bridge Foundation, Seven Star Natural Mineral Water, Top Choco, Kelt Choco Toothpaste, McBerry, and our partners, Ghana Education Service and St. John's Senior High School. At the end of round one, St. Anthony of Padua, 13 points. <laughs> Golden Star Basin School, 14 points. Barbara International School, 23 points. St. Anthony of Padua Catholic DHS would want to effect a substitution. Elizabeth Datsun will leave us and her position will be taken by Emmanuel Jima. Welcome, Emmanuel. Thank you, sir. All right. Round two. I will start with St. Anthony of Padua. You have 10 seconds, 10 seconds, one attempt. All schools, the same. The substances produced in the body to help kill germs that infect the body are known as antibodies. That is correct. <laughs> Barbara International, what is the name given to diseases that are passed on from animals to humans. Venereal disease. That is incorrect for a bonus. St. Anthony of Padua. Communicable disease. Communicable disease. That is incorrect. The answer is zoonotic diseases. Your main question. Golden star. Which organism spreads sleeping sickness? Trypanosoma. Bonus. Barbara International. Get a fly. That is correct. <laughs> the next set. These set of questions are not transferable. You either tell me whether a statement is true or false. 10 seconds within which to provide an answer. To you, St. Anthony of Padua, a chemical that can be used to test for the presence of protein in food substances is millions reagent. True. That is correct. <laughs> Barbara International, digestion of protein starts in the stomach. True. That is correct. Golden Star. A chemical that can be used to test for the presence of glucose in food substances is the Benedict solution. True. That is correct. Barbara International. What name is given to the component of a living cell responsible for respiration? Mitochondrion. That is correct. <laughs> Golden star. The organelle which occupies the largest portion of a plant cell is called the vacuum. That is correct. <laughs> For the next set, 10 seconds, one attempt only. A preamble to all of you. State the chemical formula of the following compounds. Water, St. Anthony of Padua. Capital H, substitute 2, capital O. That is correct. <laughs> Barbara International. Sodium hydroxide. Capital H. A, capital A. A, capital N. No, capital. one attempt to. One attempt. Capital. One attempt, please. I'll move on. Golden Star. Capital N. Small A. Capital O. Capital H. That is correct. 
golden star bogus so potassium oxide kaptaki kaptaki subscribe to kaptao that is correct the tossing segment for this you have 30 seconds to give an answer you can give an answer before the time is up but i have 30 seconds to work and give an answer an atom has 17 protons and 18 neutrons in it of padua 35 mass. that is incorrect i continue with the question how many electrons are present in the atom Barbara International. 17 electrons. 17 is correct. The next one. The next one. A body of mass 75 kilograms falls through a height of 7 meters. If the acceleration due to gravity is 10 meters per second squared, calculate the loss in potential energy. St. Anthony of Padua. 5,250 joules. That is correct. <laughs> An object is placed 25 centimeters in front of a plane mirror. The distance between the object and the image is Barbara International. 50 centimeters. No. St. Anthony of Padua. 25 centimeters. That is correct. <laughs> The next one. Why are some insects able to walk on water? Barbara International. Due to surface tension. That is correct. <laughs> what is the measure of the amount of water vapor in the air? Humidity. Humidity is correct. Bogo to had it. The next question. A safety device which opens an electric sec electrical circuit. A switch. St. Anthony of Padua. A switch. That is incorrect. You have your bell on. A few. That is correct. <laughs> the final question for this segment. Leguminous crops such as beans are Barbara International. Copper crops. That is incorrect. And they, they must be included in crop rotation because that is incorrect. They are rich in nitrogen. Anthony of Padua. To add nitrogen to the soil. To add nitrogen to the that soil. That is correct. I will read the, that question. I'll complete that question. The leguminous crops such as beans are cultivated to fix nitrogen into the soil. And that is the answer that St. Anthony of Padua gave. So we'll go for a commercial break. We'll come back and our contestants will tackle the problem of the day from our scientists. We are in a very tense contest. No school wants to give any quarter. No school wants to leave anything un unattended to. No stone unturned. We are at the top of round two. And in this particular segment, you would have a problem or a question from our scientist. And you give a solution within five minutes. Kindly turn over the sheets in front of you Please still put your pens down. Let us all read it. You have been given some compounds. You are required to calculate the oxidation state of those compounds and write their systematic names. For the avoidance of doubt, I'll quickly run through them. You have them in front of you. Your pens down, don't start working. KMNO4. The second one is Fe2O3. The third is Cr2O7. The fourth is Cu2O. 
The fifth is NO3 with superscript negative one. Please, you can start work. So our contestants were to calculate the oxidation state of the compounds, given compounds, and write their systematic names. So I'll just go straight on to the answer. I mean, they've presented everything there. Consultant expected that for KMN04, if you are done with everything, you will get X equals minus 1 plus A equals 7. So the systematic name will be potassium Potassium tetra oxo magnate 7. That will give you 2 marks. The next one, X is equal to 3. The oxidation state is equal to 3. The systematic name is ion 3 oxide. The third one, you would have hepta oxo chromate 7. And then the oxidation state is 7. So if you go through all the, what the consultant expected from our contestant, for Barbara International, they had questions, they calculated the oxidation states and didn't go ahead to calculate or name the, write the systematic names. So they ended up with four points, four points. For Golden Star, they did. They calculated for the oxidation states in stating the writing the <clears throat> systematic names. They had for one, they had it wrong. For three, they had it wrong. And then for five, they had it wrong. So they had seven out of ten. For the second contest running. St. Anthony of Padua, our defending champions, had everything expected from the consultants. So they had a perfect score. It is a very interesting contest. At the end of two rounds, in fact, at the end of round two, Barbara International School had 24 points for round two. Golden Star Basic School, 26 points. St. Anthony of Padua, despite the slow start, ended round two with 39 points. <laughs> we have two other rounds to go, so it is still anybody's game. But at the end of the two rounds, here are the scores. Golden Star Basic School, Bogoso, 40 points. Barbara International School, 47 points. St. Anthony of Padua, JHS, 52 points. We can move on to round three. The round for mathematics. I will start with Barbara International School. List all the members of the set X such that negative two is less than or equal to X and X is less than four. X is an integer. X is said that X got negative to negative one, zero, one, two, and three. That is correct. <laughs> Golden star. Find the number of subsets with five elements. That is, that is correct. St. Anthony of Padua. If set U is equal to, open bracket, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, bracket closed. And set Q is equal to open bracket A, B, C, and E. List the members of set Q complement. Set Q complement is equal to E. 
F, J, and H. No, for a bonus. Go it is equal to D, F, J, H. That is correct. Back to you, Barbara International. Find the sum of all even prime numbers between 1 and 20. Find the sum of all even prime numbers between 1 and 20. 2. That is correct. <laughs> Golden star. List the set of prime numbers between 20 and 30. That is divisible by 3. Now said. That is correct. St. <laughs> Anthony of Padua. List the product of all prime numbers between 10 and 15. That is divisible by 3. Zero now said. There is no prime number between 10 and 15. Which is divisible by 3. That is incorrect. St. Anthony of Padua, repeat your answer. That, that is correct. That is correct. A preamble to all schools. A preamble to all schools. Barbara International. If, so, a, a preamble to all schools before I come to the question. If vector A is equal to 1 on negative 1, and vector B is equal to negative 2 on negative 3, your question, you had the preamble, all of you. Your question, Barbara International, find 5A minus B. 7 or negative 2. That is correct. <laughs> Golden star, find 2, bracket opens, B minus A, bracket closes. B. 2 is equal to negative 6, negative 8. That is incorrect. Barbara International. Negative 3, negative 5. No. Negative 6, negative 4 is the answer. Golden Star. Sorry. Um, St. Anthony of Padua. Apologies. Find 4 bracket opens A plus B bracket closes. Negative 4, negative 16. That is correct. You have one attempt only for the next set of questions. 10 seconds to give an answer. Barbara International. How many faces has a cone? Two faces. That is correct. Golden star, how many vertices has a cylinder? Zero. That is correct. <laughs> St. Anthony of Padua, how many edges has a cone? One. That is correct. <laughs> Evaluate the following expressions. Work within 30 seconds. And any answer correctly, you earn your point. Evaluate the following expression. N squared plus 1 is equal to 82. St. Anthony of Padua. M is 9. That is correct. Square, the next one. Square root of 64 plus N is equal to 5. Barbara International. N is 3. N is 3. Not 3. St. Anthony of Padua. N is 9. N is 9. Not 9. Bogos, did you ring? M, M is equal to negative 3. N is equal to negative 3. So listen carefully. Open brackets, still with the same preamble. Open brackets, 
one whole number with seven out of nine brackets closed all squared 256 out of 81 that is correct the next set make x the subject in the relation w is equal to n minus x all over x barbara international x is equal to n out of w plus one n out of w plus one that is correct <laughs> the next one a number is chosen at random from the integers 2 to 15 15 inclusive find the probability of choosing a number that is divisible by three golden star your answer must be ready golden star five out of five out of five. into the microphone the same answer 60. the same answer i heard it into the microphone five out of 40. Five out of 40. into the microphone please five out of 40. that is correct <laughs> the next set Find the index mapping of the rule of the mapping x maps onto 2x plus 1. Bogoso Golden Star. Why, why maps to 2x plus 1? That is not correct. Why, Barbara International. Y maps to y minus 1 divided by 2. That is correct. That is correct. In a school, 80 pupils wrote an examination and 16 of them failed what is the percentage of the pupils who passed saint anthony of padua 80 percent that is correct <laughs> so that brings us to the end of round three we go for a commercial break and be back with the score Banana. Banana? Okay, Dad. Including mocha, Cabo has five flavors. Banana, strawberry, chocolate malt, and coconut. What is the fifth one? Strawberry. No. <laughs> uh, are you feeling hot? Honey, including mocha, Cabo has five flavors. Strawberry, banana, chocolate malt, coconut. What's the fifth one? Choco malt. Hey! Coconut. Hey! Nutritious and refreshing. Cowbell has a flavor for everyone. They think I don't know. Cowbell, our milk. This advert is FDA approved. Welcome back from the commercial break. This final semi final contest promised from the onset to be a very fiercely contested one. And our contestants have not disappointed. A round of applause to all six of them. In round three, at the end of round three, Golden Star Business School, Bogoso, had 21 points. St. Anthony of Padua ended the round with 25 points. Barbara International ended that round with 26 points. So this is how 
the schools are doing going into the final round the power round golden star basic school 61 points barbara international school 73 points saint anthony of padua 77 points barbara international school before we start round four would want to effect a substitution 10 questions will be posed to you you would have 60 seconds within which to give an answer please if you do not have an answer readily available to a question tell me clearly to skip or move on each question answered correctly would give you two points you have 10 questions so 20 points are at stake all the best Golden Star Bogoso, are you ready? What is the name given to the fear of books? Skip. Skip. Which country's name means fine feathers? Skip. Skip. In which year did Nigeria gain independence? 1960. That is correct. In which year was the Yasantua War fought? 1900. 19. Zero, zero. zero. No. 1901. Correct. What sound does a beetle make? Uh. Skip. What name is given to the study of birds? Skip. What name is given to the loss of appetite? Skip. Skip. Appetitism. <laughs> what is the scientific name of ginger? Skip. Who invented the anemometer? Skip. In which country was Ebola first detected? Like Congo. No. Dear what is the name given to the fear of books? Bookphobia. <laughs> no bookphobia. Which country's name means fine feathers? Australia. No. So the name given to the fear of books is bibliophobia, not bookphobia. That was a fine attempt. The country which, whose name means fine feathers is Morocco. You got the year Nigeria gained independence, correct? The year the Yasantua war was fought. The sound a beetle makes, drone. They make the drone sound. The name given to the study of birds is ornithology. Ornithology. Spelled O-R-N-I-T-H-O-L-O-G-Y. The name given to the loss of appetite is anorexia. And then the scientific name of ginger is Zigimba Officinal, the one who invented anemometer, is, the, is Leon Battista Alberti, and Ebola was first detected in Guinea. Please, the school with the envelope marked B or 2. Barbara International, are you ready? What is the name given to the fear of height? Height phobia. No. Which country's name means land of honest people? Liberia. No. In which year did Zambia gain independence? 1960. No. In which year was the capital city of Ghana changed? 1887. No. What sound does an ape make? Skip. What name is given to the study of X? Skip. What name is given to the feel or longing for home? Homesick. Homesickness, I'll take that. What, scientific, what is the scientific name of rice? Skip. Who invented the amplitude modulation? Skip. In which year was the first case of Ebola recorded? Skip. What name is given to the fear of height? Heightphobia. Continue. You had homesickness or nostalgia, correct? The name given to the fear of height is acrophobia. Acrophobia. Burkina Faso. The name Burkina Faso means land of honest people. Zambia gained independence in 1964, actually on 24th October 1964. The capital city of Ghana was changed in 1877. 1877, not 1887. Apes, apes geba. The sound apes make is geba. They geba. 
The name given to the study of X is Orogy, O O L O G Y. The scientific name of rice is Oriza sativa, Oriza sativa. Reginald Fessenden invented the amplitude modulation, and the year in which the first case of Ebola was recorded was 2014. So obviously, St. Anthony of Padua, you are the one left, your envelope. Kingsford and my chairman, are you ready? What name is given to the fear of insects? Yep. Which country's name means land of liberty? Liberia. Correct. In which year did Zimbabwe gain independence? Skip. In which year was the poll tax ordinance instituted in the Gold Coast? 1852. That is correct. What sound does an elephant make? A trumpet. Correct. What is the name given to the study of worms? Skip. What is the name given to the irresistible desire for alcohol? Skip. What is the scientific name of garlic? Skip. Who invented the barometer? Skip. Skip. In which year did the hardest hit countries declare themselves Ebola free? Skip. What is the name given to the fear of insects? Sinophobia. No. In which year did Zimbabwe gain independence? 1964. No. So, for the power round, St. Anthony of Padua has three questions correctly answered. These were the questions they were unable to provide an answer or answered wrongly. The name given to the fear of insects is entomophobia. Entomophobia. The year Zimbabwe gained independence is 1980. 18 April 1980. The name given to the study of worms is helminthology. Helminthology. The name given to the irresistible desire for alcohol is dipsomania. Dipsomania. The scientific name of garlic is allium sativum. The barometer was invented by Evangelista Torricel. Tor Evangelista Torricel. And the year that the hardest hit countries declared themselves Ebola free is June 2016. So you had three questions correctly answered. Viewers will go for the final scores. We'll announce our winners. You will agree with me that it has been a very hard fought battle. The winners will be declared when we come back from the commercial break. Kindly stay tuned in. Banana. Banana? Okay, Dad. Including mocha, Cabo has five flavors. Banana, strawberry, chocomalt, and coconut. What is the fifth one? Strawberry. No. <laughs> uh, are you feeling hot? Honey, including mocha, Cabo has five flavors. Strawberry, banana, chocomalt, coconut. What's the fifth one? Choco malt? Hey! Coconut! Hey! Nutritious and refreshing, Cowbell has a flavor for everyone. They think I don't know. This advert is FDA approved. My friends, my name is Kelkit Toothpaste. Wow. I was made to be gentle on your gum, but protected. I will protect your teeth from cavity, make your teeth whiter, stronger, keep your mouth fresh all day. And best of all, I'm strawberry flavored. So put on a smile and try me. That's amazing. Just try me. That's my job. If you say so, jump on my brush. brush. Make your teeth stronger, chicky chicky whiter, chicky chicky stronger. Yay! You did it! I'm glad you like your new toothpaste. Don't forget to brush both day and night. Girl kids, happy smile.
welcome back from the commercial break we had two previous very exciting contest for our third semi-final the final or the last semi-final the three schools promised us nothing but the best from the onset they didn't disappoint and after an enthralling four rounds of competition here are the scores golden star basic school bogoso ended the contest with 65 points Barbara International School had 75 points. It is said that champions die hard. At the beginning, St. Anthony of Padua Catholic DHS said that they were going to win this contest, move on to the final, defend that trophy, and do a back-to-back. -back. They didn't disappoint. They ended the contest with 83 points. So the list for the final is completed. In the final, we would have St. Peter's International School, Anadji, Tessac International School, Pesimin Team, and St. Anthony of Padua Catholic DHS from Presumitim competing. Kingsford and my chairman. You would agree with me that it was a very hard fought victory. I urge you to work harder. I do not know what will happen in the final, but I know that it is going to be tougher than this. Whatever it is, the best of luck, work harder, and let me see you in the final, even with a better performance. To our two other schools, Barbara International and Golden Star Basic School, Bogoso, you fought hard. You fought hard. You've done well. There was only one ticket at stake, and your compatriot or your competitors from St. Anthony of Padua had it. Viewers, the 2022 edition of the CCWBB, the semi-final contest has ended. We'll come your way with the final contest between St. Peter's International School, Tessac International School, and St. Anthony of Padua College DHS. I have been your quiz master, Albert Abedu. Thank you. It's body beats the drum beat. Yeah. Tune the radio the never too nice of one point one. I was oh yeah. Tune they have some fun. One oh, yeah. boy you know I hard to that track they be on my heart. Ball I one band them so I better not talk about. Oh, yeah. Sports and entertainment events and current affairs. I don't care about it. I didn't know be a little you to take ya and it ya Wow, radio, mamu radio Yeah, you know your radio, what's the rage in my babu? Wow, radio, mamu radio Yeah, you know your radio, what's the rage in my babu? Radio, it's a radio, a radio, a wire radio. The one bobo on your papa, more authentic news on your college if we want the view. Nah, Fato Connect, a higher bow on your papa by now. Yami put tune in, yeah, also correct. Taxi drivers are my mother who will go me now. By now, we'll be at to connect. Connect FM 97.1. Yeah, no one now. It's body beats the drum beat. 
Still no radio, they never told nice of 1.1 Ah, yeah, I was, oh yeah Till they have some fun I'm by you, I'm now a hot jet track, they be on my heart Ball I want band them, so I better not talk about Sports and entertainment, events and occurrence affairs I didn't be a reality I didn't be a reality, oh, today, they are the job Wow, radio, mamu radio Yeah, you know, yeah, radio, Western region, mwa kwa Radio, it's a radio, a tea radio, a wire radio. The one bobo on your papa more authentic news on your college if we want the view. Nah, Fato Connect. A higher bow on your papa by now, you're me pay tune in. Yeah, also correct. Taxi drivers are mama for who will go me now. By now, we'll be at that to connect.